Welcome back to my channel Techno Trends on the drone community has been buzzing, and now we've got confirmation that's going to get everyone talking. The DJI Neo 2 has officially passed through the FCC approval process. This may sound like just another routine filing, but in the world of drone innovation, FCC clearance is often the green light that tells us a product is one big step closer to store shelves. It's essentially the last checkpoint for wireless devices before they make their debut in the US market. And this development means the wait for DJI's latest palm-sized marvel could soon be over, for those new to the Neo series, the original. DJI Neo became a fan favorite among vloggers, travel bloggers, and casual hobbyists. Why? Because it packed an impressive set of features into a tiny, ultralight frame, we're talking portability that fits in your palm, without compromising on stability, video quality, or ease of use. Now, with the Neo 2, DJI looks set to Refine that winning formula, delivering small but significant upgrades that could make it the go-to drone for beginner pilots and seasoned creators alike. A major power boost, more airtime for creative shots perhaps the most talked about upgrade is the battery. The Neo 2 now comes with a 1606 mAh battery, up from the 1435 mAh pack in the original. That's roughly a 10 to 12% increase in capacity. While the numbers might seem modest, in the drone world, even small gains can mean big creative wins. Under typical flight conditions, this translates to around 20 minutes of airtime, 2 or 3 extra minutes compared to the NEO.IN practice. Those extra minutes can be the difference between finishing your perfect aerial sweep over a coastal cliff at sunset or having to land prematurely. For vloggers, travel filmmakers, and urban explorers, longer battery life means fewer interruptions, more location coverage, and more chances to capture cinematic transitions without having to swap batteries mid-shoot, and for those who film events, weddings, sports, street festivals, that extra airtime could be a lifesaver when you're working with fleeting moments. Design philosophy, compact, compliant, and ready to travel one of the reasons the Neo series is so beloved is its ultralight 135 gram build. The Neo 2 maintains this design choice, keeping it comfortably below the FAA's 250-gram registration threshold. That means you can fly legally in the US without going through the paperwork and fees that heavier drones require, this isn't just a convenience, it's a creative enabler. Imagine flying in a foreign city without stressing about complex drone laws, or packing it in your carry-on for a hiking trip without sacrificing space for your other gear. The Neo 2 is still palm-sized, keeping it traveler and backpack friendly beginner friendly yet creator capable if you've never flown a drone before the neo series is about as approachable as it gets the neo 2 is expected to keep dji's full propeller guards palm takeoff and landing and quickshot ai flight modes automated flight patterns that produce professional looking clips without requiring expert piloting skills features like these bridge the gap between casual users and professional creators even if you've never studied drone cinematography QuickShot can execute smooth orbit shots, dronies, and cinematic pans that look like they came straight from a travel documentary. The content creator's edge, why the Neo 2 matters more flight, more footage for vloggers and YouTubers, drone footage isn't just a gimmick, it's a storytelling tool. Those few extra minutes of battery power can mean more establishing. Shots for your intro, more smooth transitions between scenes, and more time to experiment with new angles. Portability meets Power A Sub 250G drone with 4K video at 30 frames per second is rare in this price range. The Neo 2 allows anyone with a smartphone to level up their production quality. You don't need a Hollywood budget or a crew, just a compact drone, a bit of planning, and your creative vision. Affordability and accessibility if DJI can keep the Neo 2 close to the original's $199 price tag, it will remain one of the most accessible entry points into high-quality aerial videography. That's a huge win for creators who want pro-level footage without investing in bigger, pricier drones. Regulatory and supply chain watchouts FCC approval is a promising sign, but history tells us not to get too comfortable. Recently, other drones, like the Mavic 4 Pro, faced customs delays tied to the UFLPA, which can slow down US imports. While there's no direct evidence that the Neo 2 will face the same hurdles, it's a factor worth keeping an eye on for those planning to buy as soon as it launches. What's missing, so far, from the FCC filings, there's no sign of a radical redesign, no brand new gimbal system, no groundbreaking sensor upgrade, and no dramatic shift in build materials. This is less a reinvention and more a refinement. That might disappoint users hoping for a massive leap forward, but it also speaks to DJI's confidence in the NEO's original design. The upgrades that do appear, like improved battery life, are targeted at making the drone more practical and enjoyable to use day-to-day. -day. The competitive landscape, where the Neo 2 fits the market for ultralight drones is heating up, 
with competitors like the Rise Teo, Hubsan Zeno Mini SE, and even DJI's own Mini series offering solid performance at compact sizes. But the Neo 2's likely combination of affordability, portability, and intelligent flight modes could set it apart, especially for creators on a budget. Whereas the Mini 3 and Mini 4 Pro target more advanced pilots and come with higher price tags, the Neo 2 stays laser-focused on the grab-and-go audience, people who want to shoot and share without the complexity of mastering pro-level flight systems. Potential release timeline, eyes on Q for the FCC listing puts the Neo 2 right on schedule for a late 2025 launch, possibly timed with the October to November holiday shopping season. DJI often uses this window to capitalize on the tech buying. Rush, and a palm-sized, affordable drone is a perfect fit for gift lists. If DJI sticks to its playbook, we can expect official teasers in the next month or two, followed by a full reveal and pre-order period leading right into the holiday season, final thoughts, the drone to watch for 2025 the DJI Neo 2 might not be a revolution, but it could easily become one of the most creator-friendly drones of the year. By combining longer flight time, extreme portability, ease of use, and a wallet-friendly price, DJI has positioned it as a must-watch release for anyone interested in aerial photography or videography, whether you're a travel vlogger, content creator, adventure junkie, or just someone who wants to add cinematic flair to your personal videos.